It's another exciting episode of Fidelity Weekly. Welcome, everyone. My name is Junior, aka Social Butterfly, and I have amazing guests in the building. So you'll be surprised we have cables here because today we did settle matter on top of this table. We did bring some things kind on top of this table, and we go scatter this table today. <laughs> first if your dad and your mom i'm going to start with sk if your dad and your mom are quarreling and you bump into them and your dad says go i need to talk to mom see and your mom says no sk stay okay no sk okay who would you listen to uh, or what would you do Stop. okay i think i'll just take a walk <laughs> Jaba, Jaba. <laughs> okay feelings what we do today uh, depends on what's going on. If it's serious, okay. Let's say I don't perceive anything in being like getting violent. Yeah, I'll take a walk. You take a walk so they answer pop pop. They should do their thing. You should do. <laughs> Gifty, what we need to do? I'll take a seat. Okay. And yeah. watch? And just watch. <laughs> and laugh. And laugh. <laughs> because it's about to choose, about to get real. <laughs> so I'll just take a seat and just watch. How about if they, how about if it gets really heated? That's why I'm there. Would you take sides? No, there's, there's no need to take sides. But first of all, humans. So let no one hit anyone first, mm -hmm. you know? Other than that, they can sort it out by themselves. I mean, they're old. <coughs> they should have them. Yeah, my, my mom said, my mom said, Corinne, don't even put your mouth. They'll use you and settle the score. <laughs> they'll first use you and they'll table your matter. Then they'll settle their fight. So I, I don't even bother. Then you'll be the black sheep. Do you understand? Now, gift. You find a suitcase in an alley and Oh, it's kind of open. <laughs> it's oh, kind of open. On. And you can actually see like dollars and you go close. You can in your because you're a banker, you don't wear them. You don't see say if you'd reach like almost one hundred thousand dollars. But there's a note with blood stains on it that wrote that is written boldly, don't. What would you do? Just don't. Just don't. Sorry, your instruction is not clear. I'm going to that very <laughs> instruction is not clear. Don't, don't what? Don't what? Okay, don't leave it. It's mm. Okay, don't leave it. Don't leave the money there. Don't leave the money there. Okay, so feelings. Your your feelings, yeah. So you decide to take mom C and your boo out. Now there's this. You're driving now, and uh, wife is babe says I want to sit in front. Mom C wants to sit in front. How do you settle this matter? I don't want to be in your shoes. <laughs> First of all, I. I feel like uh, no mom should put their kids in such a tight situation over something that petty. How then, about no babe should put their man in such a situation? See, even the Bible, I don't want to get religious, but even the Bible you know, says it. We are now one. But, and um, I believe mom still will understand. Sorry, excuse me. So, is it is it married girlfriend or girlfriend girlfriend? All joint. All joint. Okay, just a, a partner. Partner. Yeah, 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 a partner. Yeah. First off, I believe yeah, I won't find myself in that situation because I know my mom, but since we are speaking, mm, yeah. We are shaking tables. Mom still will understand. She will be back. I'm living with that partner. Mom still will finish and go. And go to her man. Yeah. SK. Uh, I'll say the same thing too. What's the, what's the thing? Okay, let's just say. If it's actually a heated argument, Mom still wants to sit in front and babe wants to sit in front. Okay, no problem. <laughs> babe will drive, Mom still will sit in front. I sit at the back. <laughs> 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 okay. What would you do if you got too drunk and cheated on your partner? Now, in 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 Gifty. Oh. I would tell him. You would. I would. I would tell him. You sure? I would tell him. What would you say? What is it? Well, now it's time to fight though. But <laughs> I would tell him because it, it would be on my mind, and I, I wouldn't want that. Yeah, it would be on my mind, and I wouldn't want that. SK. If she finds out. Uh oh, she doesn't. Oh, wow. <laughs> if she finds out. No, no. Oh, I'm if she finds so out. Okay. <laughs> if she finds out, you settle it. She doesn't find Brother, out. Brother, the table is broken. No, no, it's not broken <laughs> yet. I, there's still a leg standing, okay. actually. So if she finds out, you settle. She doesn't find out. Mm. Keep, keep it cool, you know? Just keep it cool. To save the stress, you know? Mm. Take it to your grave. But sometimes arguments are not really too cool, uh -huh. you know? So, and that's not necessary. Yeah. Feelings. Actually, yeah. Then I go tell her more. 
oh. my conscience would your be feelings would just be everywhere. So I'm the bad boy here. <laughs> 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 Okay. No problem. Yeah, no I think problem. I'll tell her. Are you sure? Yeah. I hope not because you're in front of the camera. No, nah, I think I'll tell her. Have you actually done something oh. to your partner, against your partner, and you had to tell her? Have you ever? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Though he spoiled things, I regretted telling her anyway. Cause... And this one, you want to tell her? See? Uh, I just feel like, let's see. You see? If it's gonna work, it's gonna work. If it's not gonna yeah. work. You're driving along in your car on a wild stormy night, okay? And it's raining heavily. When suddenly you pass by a bus stop, okay? So you see three people waiting for a bus. An old lady who looks like she's about to die. An old friend who once saved your life. And the perfect partner you've been dreaming about. Oh. Who would you pick up for that ride? And you have to pick only one person. Uh... I should pay my debt. The Lannister. Okay, the, the person that saved your life. Yeah. SK. Okay, this is a nice time to lose. Uh, ah. Save my life. Jesus saved my life too. <laughs> <laughs> but then, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> Savage. <laughs> No, see these things are very realistic. Okay. They are not very realistic. Yeah, so, so, so who are you picking? Your perfect partner. Ah, okay, this is really tight actually. Okay, let me pay this back. So, so let's see. No, 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 the perfect partner. <laughs> Let's just make this thing quite easy. Yeah. No the perfect partner. Let me know one. Gifty. No, I would pay my debt. Okay, I would pay my debt because the old woman, for, for all we know, she might be enjoying the rain and she looks like she's about to die. Okay. To Jesus be her glory. You see it? Eh? <laughs> to Jesus be her glory. <laughs> but you see, the person that saved my life, I, I can't leave you there. How about your perfect partner? I would see another perfect partner. Yeah, there's always life. one perfect partner in your life. Yeah, there's right. never one perfect partner. Dun, dun. There's never one perfect partner. <laughs> Never. <laughs> so, okay, gift. I'm gonna ask you this directly. You're on the first date with someone, and they promise to answer the next question you ask completely honest, yeah, okay. leaving out no details. What question would you ask on your first date? Completely honest. Yes. Not no details. Huh. I would ask the person what kind of uh, financial plan they have for their life, <laughs> without. Mm -hmm. Without leaving any details, so you have to let me know. Th that's to that's, yeah, that, that's to like. How about if the person doesn't have like a prospect? Well, that's why you're telling me, so I know not to waste my time. Okay, financial state, banker. I see you. Yes. See you. Thank you. To we'll start with, um, do you have sense? <laughs> It's very key. <laughs> then I think so, I'll get sense, but not get sense. We will discover. <laughs> so uh, you you will go on the next date and the next date and we'll the next discover. date. Small small things go show. For the date and for the first yeah. date, I mean. Who knows get sense? You know? <laughs> uh, then maybe short term, long term goals when it comes to you know personal development, career wise, or just to be sure like you're with someone that has sense, last last. Exactly. Let's go. Long term goes really Long term. How about short term? Short term has come. Yeah. Long term goes. <laughs> Let me know where you're coming. Brotherly. Let me know where you're coming. Oh. SK. Okay. You're held at gunpoint. Go for a B door. And the gunman asks you for a reason why he shouldn't pull the trigger. What would you tell him? Yes, I'm vulnerable to this world. They need me. They obviously need me. I can't deal. <laughs> Feelings. <laughs> what would you do? Because it's more my mom. Oh. So. You don't know your mom and I do. Leave me alive, man. Mm. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Gifty. I'll just tell the guy. <laughs> I'm bad, brother. We are family now. We don't need to do this. <laughs> don't we are in the struggle together. We don't need to do this. We are in the streets. We are in the streets together. We don't need to do this. We don't need it. It's not ne necessary. I think the guy will just leave his gun and run away. <laughs> you guys are the most. Okay, so a gift. Would you rather date someone you love who doesn't love you back or date someone who loves you and you don't love back? I would rather date someone I love that doesn't love me back. Are you sure? sure? Why so? Because if you love me and, um, okay, if you love me and you're excessive and you show me all these things, you know, at some point, okay, for, 
for myself. Let me speak for myself. At some point, it will get irritating. I won't want to be around you because you're just too much and all that. That's the kind of, I'm not, okay. you know, I'd rather date someone that I, I know I can give you everything I have, you know, and I know that it's selfless. You don't need to give me back. You don't need, you don't like mushy mushy love. Jesus I'm Christ. Oh, <laughs> feelings, I like you, you're always in your feelings, right? <laughs> Man, for me, yeah. I think I'll prefer someone that loves me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, so you grow to love the person that exactly. you like. You like attention. You love attention. You crave attention. Yeah, I'll say that it's painful when you're, you know, you're not getting the energy back, man. It's painful. So I prefer someone that loves me. Yeah. Then you now, you know, reciprocate. Yeah. Sk. I think it's a guy thing. What's a guy thing? I'm not a guy. I'd, I'd prefer she loves me more. Yeah. <laughs> but do you guys know that women are more emotional beings than men? Uh, yes. We'll so even if it. you love the woman more than she loves you, they'll get to a point where her love will overflow. You need, say, 10 million. Mm -hmm. And the only person that can give you that 10 million is the sugar daddy material. Would you go with him? <laughs> he said what? You need 10 million naira. Okay. Urgently. And uh, the only person that can let go of this 10 million is the sugar daddy potential. Huh. Would, he ask for would sugar? you would you accept the sugar? Question B, would he ask for sugar? He would definitely ask. <laughs> what am I using the 10 million for so urgently? Well, I don't know. Life happens. Oh, wow. This is a sugar daddy issue. We'll take the sugar and we'll move on. <laughs> we'll take the sugar and we'll move on. <laughs> Life continues. <laughs> Life na gaga. Life na gaga, my sister. Feelings. Uh, sugar mommy. Sugar mommy now. Mm, that's a tough one. Depends on what's at stake anyway. 10 million is at stake. Urgent mm -hmm. need of 10 million is at stake. Bro. So it's just small sugar. I have plenty of sugar. <laughs> you, you have sugar to give. <laughs> oh, I have a lot of love to give. <laughs> SK. Okay, 10 million life at stake. Sugar is needed. Just take it. Just take sugar. Just take it. <laughs> I've had a fantastic time, you all. Today has been fantastic. Thank you, SK. Thank you, Feelings. Yep. Thank you, Gifty. We have one word for everybody watching Fidelity Weekly. Subscribe. Stay happy, guys. Don't stop watching. Okay, guys. So don't stop watching. Please like, share, subscribe. Tell everybody about Fidelity Weekly. And we look forward to you watching all our episodes every time. I am Chinere, aka Social Butterfly. And this is Fidelity Weekly. From us here, it is. Bye. Bye. Fidelity. We keep our word.